A company is evaluating the effectiveness of two different training programs for their employees. A random sample of 200 employees who completed the first training program showed that 100 of them passed a certification exam, while a random sample of 250 employees who completed the second training program showed that 140 of them passed the exam. A 95% confidence interval was constructed to estimate the difference in the proportion of employees who passed the exam for the two training programs. The resulting confidence interval was from negative nine thousandths to 169 thousandths. What can be concluded about the difference in the proportion of employees who passed the exam for the two training programs at a 95% confidence level? Is it choice A that there is significant evidence to conclude that the proportion of employees who pass the exam for the two training programs is different? Is it B, the test is inclusive and further analysis is needed? Is it C, there is significant evidence to conclude that the proportion of employees who pass the exam for the first training program is higher than the second training program? Or is it D, there is significant evidence to conclude that the proportion of employees who pass the exam for the second training program is higher than the first training program? Well, the 95% confidence interval for the difference in proportions of employees who pass the exams for the two training program is given to us in the problem. It's from negative nine thousandths to 169 thousandths. And since the interval includes zero, meaning that zero falls between these two, we cannot conclude with confidence that there is a significant difference in the proportion of employees who passed the exam for the two training programs at the 5% level of confidence or the 95% confidence level. This means that we do not have sufficient evidence to say that one training program is better than the other. Therefore, the correct answer to this problem is choice B. The test is inconclusive and further analysis is needed.